The closeout medical record process is where a member of the team reviews the medical records for completeness and accuracy. The closeout process should be performed by the team, medical director, or medical officer on duty. This ensures that the records are an accurate representation of the treatment provided in the field. There are two important things to remember in the closeout process. First, patients can only have one medical record open at a time. So until their medical record is closed, they will not be able to record an additional visit at that location. Also, once the record is closed, updates to the various fields in the record cannot be made. The only information that can be added is in the form of an addendum note or an addendum attachment. Because of this, it is important to be sure that the record is accurate and complete before it is closed out. To close out a medical record, navigate to the patient dashboard. Notice when the patient dashboard opens that the Add Visit button is grayed out. This is because the patient has an open medical record. To close the open record, tap on the Close Out button located on the right side of the screen. When the Close Out screen opens, it displays the results of the completeness checks that are performed on the medical record. Any item that appears in the arrow section of the screen needs to be addressed before the record can be closed. If there are any items in this section, the Close Out Record button in the bottom right corner of the screen is grayed out. Items that appear in the Warning section are the nice-to-have items that we should try to get from the patient if they are still in the treatment area. If there are errors listed, tap the Cancel button and return to the applicable screen to add the required information. When the record check is performed and all errors are resolved, no errors will show on the Close Out screen. The team medical director or medical officer on duty will need to select the box that acknowledges that this medical record is an accurate representation of the medical encounter. The team medical director or medical officer on duty will need to select the box that acknowledges that this medical record is an accurate representation of the medical encounter. Then they would tap the close out record button. Once the record is closed out, you will see on the patient dashboard that a red border appears around the screen. The patient name is red and the Add Visit button is enabled. If the patient returns for treatment at your location, you can create a new record by tapping on the Add Visit button. Information cannot be entered into any of the fields in the closed record. However, if information becomes available after the record has been closed, it can still be added using an addendum note. To add an addendum note or attachment, select the closed record on the patient dashboard, then tap on the Notes button. The Notes screen for the patient will open, showing all of the notes for this record. Tap on the Add button. The Create Notes screen opens and defaults to the note type Addendum. You can enter whatever information you would like. If the patient comes back for treatment or follow-up to the same location and the record has been properly closed out, another visit can be added to the patient's record. To do this, tap on the Add Visit button located on the patient dashboard. Basic information has been transferred over to this visit, such as the name, address, date of birth, etc. It is suggested that information be verified again for accuracy, particularly address and contact information. Note that the red border is gone and the patient's name is no longer in red. At the bottom of the screen, under Medical Records, there are two listings. The first line is the current visit. You can review the previous record by tapping on the previous visit. The record is shown bordered in red, indicating that the record has been closed. Even though it is closed, the Add Visit button is grayed out, indicating that there is another record open for this patient. From this display, you can tap through the screens on the left of the screen to see what happened during the previous visit.